All right, Ashley, have we already done our schoolwork today? Well, I'm almost done. You're almost done. We're taking a break because we're gonna go through her closet. That up there is whose? Keely that she's passing down to Chelsea. Yeah. And then All that is Abby and Kaylee passing it down to Chelsea. And those bags are And Chelsea's down. passing it down to Kate Ashley. But we need to clean Ashley's out first. Is it a little me? overwhelming? Well, it's hard. Yeah, it is hard. Okay, so we start. Let's explain what we got here. We've got all your clothes right here, and then we have some summer stuff down here, right? Yeah. So we have some of her skirts and stuff over here. Oh. Summer dresses. Some of these are fall, winter dresses over here. These are all your summer tank tops oh, right I here. And t-shirts. What we need to do is make sure that those all still fit and move those down here, right? So you can start wearing those ones. These ones. Those are Chelsea's. <laughs> these ones right here are Chelsea's. And then these. And those ones are yours. But this one was Chelsea's and then I And now it's yours, yeah. right? Yeah, it was way. Okay, so that's our goal, is to move some of your summer stuff, spring stuff, down to your side of the closet. Okay, so we're gonna start on this side. I'm not gonna do time lapse. But I'm going to go through all these. What we're going to do, Ashley, is we're going to take out the long sleeves. And if they're not going to fit you next school year, we're going to donate them. Okay? All right. We made a lot of progress <laughs> right here. Huh, Ashley? Yeah. We have some short sleeve shirts. This is all, like, I haven't moved anything new down here. So it's just helpful to see all the short sleeve shirts that we can choose from. Right, Chelsea? Or Ashley? Yeah. Sorry. And we have one long sleeve shirt just on a little bit of colder days and this one won't last clear till the fall size wise so we'll get one more like season in the springtime use out of that and then we're starting to add some skirts this is her jean skirt and she's never worn this one before but we'll start wearing that one with some leggings and then we've got jeans and leggings and sweatpants here and then we've got some dresses right there so we're going to add to this from the other side then down here we've taken out all the long sleeve shirts that no longer we no longer need right now for this season but they will fit her next school year if we actually go back to school <laughs> or we can still wear them when we're at home right yeah. you're all black because of the window all right Ashley I'm gonna hand some of these to you okay we're gonna go with these down here and then I've got a bunch of shirts right yeah. okay can you hold those ones too until I get the other side opened we're gonna take I don't know if I'll do the dresses we'll see um maybe I will that's Chelsea's right there so it starts Chelsea's over there and then we've got some of your dresses up here we might as well take some of this down see all these skirts we actually need to see if some of these shirts fit. This is like. Do you want to? She tried on the sweatshirt. Do you want to try that one on and make sure it fits? Definitely. It like says it's a size six, so I'm kind of worried. But I'm a seven. I think I'm a seven eight. You are. Do you want to just try that on or no? Yeah. Do you want to get rid of it? Yeah. Okay, put it in the pile. That's our giveaway pile. So we're gonna go through these other T-shirts and make sure that they will work as well. All right, so on this side, we have all those long sleeve shirts. We've just moved back over to this side along with the jeans. And then some of her winter dresses are gonna stay over here because we're actually not going to church right now during quarantine. And I don't think we'll be going when the weather is cold. I think we're at least a month or two away from going to church. So I don't think they're gonna get used until the fall. So put those ones there. And this is still leftover stuff from Chelsea. And um, so we'll leave that all there. This is all Chelsea's summer stuff. I actually don't know if she's even going to wear this stuff. So I've got to figure out Chelsea's side in a bit. In the meantime, I pulled down some of these bags. I think this one up here is leftovers from like it's just hand-me-downs. But I think that one up there is too big. But I think I can pull a few things out of this one, right Ashley? I don't think we need that gold or this black glittery skirt. It was too, well, it's just too fancy for summertime. So we're going to go through this. Just found a few that can be added to the mix over here. So Ashley's side is now done. She's got all these t-shirts to choose from, one long sleeve shirt, a whole bunch of tank tops for spring and summer, 
And then we've got skirts and shorts, skirts, and then we have some sweatpants here. Oh, the sweatpants are in the wrong place. They go right here. So on colder days, she can pull out the sweatpants or the leggings if she needs to. But then she has the skirts if she wants to. Then over here we have dresses, more play dresses down here. I don't know, that shawl probably can go up. But we have just more sundresses and play dresses on that side. All right, the more daunting task is Chelsea's side because she doesn't wear any of these. So I'm, I'm struggling with her because she has all these good clothes and she just won't wear any of them. All right, before I show you the final result, this has got a, this has been kind of a pain. Pulling of teeth, right Chels? It's been kind of hard. <laughs> no comment. So Chelsea, what's this pile in the bucket here? Stuff. Okay, that's why it's been hard. So first of all, this bucket here has shorts that Chelsea can wear now. They're a little bit big, but she can cinch them up and she is a short girl. So we need all the extra shorts we can get. Correct? Mm -hmm. And look, she's wearing a new shirt. Not new, just different. That's been our struggle. So we have a pile of clothes here that have been handed down from Kaylee and Abby that we're gonna save for Chelsea later. And this pile here, our pants she's never worn for the past two years that fit her perfectly fine, but she just won't wear. Do any of you have any kids that are like this. Perfectly good pants, the jeans she wore once, whatever. Luckily I have another daughter. Same with these shirts right here. Ashley. We just won't wear any of these shirts again. So they pass down to Ashley. But their size is like 10, 12. So Ashley's got a couple years before she can wear those. Are you getting where I'm kind of frustrated because we already have two of these bags up here. So now I've got another one <laughs> that I've got to get for all of this. Moving to over here, this is how many clothes we got rid of, right Chels? Mm -hmm. All the hangers. And no, then that's not all the clothes. That was just some extra clothes and then now some of those were from like other people. The blue <laughs> hangers are all yours, my friend. Sorry. But some most of them were just empty hangers and I don't Um know there wasn't them. a single empty hanger in yes, your closet. There no there wasn't. Yes there was. Shh. Yes it was. We're donating all of these clothes here on the floor. This is just laundry with extra pant hangers that need to go downstairs. And then we'll take all these hangers downstairs to store because we don't have any more clothes. By the way, cute outfit, Ashley. Mm -hmm. She tried on some shorts and a, her old sweatshirt to make sure it fits. And then I just keep the sweatshirt on and then you fit. That sweatshirt this, this springtime is it. After it doesn't fit, because hands up belly up <laughs> that's our rule hands up belly up and if it if we see a belly button what happens then we have to be, we have to be done what do you oh. <laughs> hands up show me nope all the way up show me stand up no stand up your shirt is actually not that bad all right we saw Ashley's down there and now we see Chelsea's you guys it gets even better there's nothing in between. Literally, that's how much we got rid of. Even like, look. It's, it's insane how much we got rid of. Right, Ash? Yeah, and then like, wait, you can just like be back here. I'm gonna have stuff right there. And I'm no, I don't want you to have stuff back there. I want it to be cleaned out, Goober. So Chelsea's side up here, we have agreed on a few shirts. There are a few meaning like 20, but you know, this is progress. Mm -hmm. So we've got a whole bunch of tank tops right here. And then we have uh, about five sport shirts right here. They're kind of that. About six. No, one, two, three, four. four. Yeah. And then we have all these t-shirts. And you would think that this isn't that big a deal and that someone should be grateful to have all these t-shirts. But she literally normally only wears, out of these ones here, she wears that one. I actually In wore all one. pink. To She'll wear the sweatshirts. No. Just She'll wear the pink. sweatshirts right here. We're working on wearing the t-shirt. Okay, Chelsea, tell them what I'm doing with your other shirts that we know they have seen in every video we've done during quarantine. Okay. What shirts am I getting rid of? See if there's one in the laundry basket, Ash. Mm -hmm. Because you're done with it, it doesn't fit anymore. Oh yeah, it does. Sorry. See if that t-shirt is in her laundry basket. Is there in here? Mm -hmm. No, that one, it, that one she can keep, that one she can keep. 
Yeah. What one is getting? Oh, yeah. They get washed. What one in there is getting thrown away? Any shirt like that is getting thrown away. That one's a good shirt. No, it doesn't go there. It doesn't get donated. It's going to get thrown away. Put it back in the laundry basket. It's not a good it shirt is. anymore. It's like sleeping. I get home. Um, so what shirt did you just get for sleeping? Show them. Like one big fat one. No, one big fat one. Show them the what. It's so long though. It's not fat. Long it's does long. not mean. Okay, but what does it say on it? Hawaii? Stop. It says Hawaii. Oh, with... Actually, you're incorrect. Does it say aloha? No, you're incorrect. Okay. <laughs> Hey, if we don't get to go to Hawaii, what do you want? Do you want me to make a deal with you? You'll get me candy and like a shirt. No, no, no. Like a house no, I will have my Walmart. aunt go to Walmart in Hawaii and Where's get you aunt? the one that's there right now. Oh, okay. I have an aunt that's there visiting her kids right now. I will have her go to the store and get you some and have, them ship, have her ship it to us. If you start wearing different t-shirts during the day and that shirt oh, as pajamas. Going nowhere. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. You need to wear different shirts. Okay. So now the goal is to clean up this mess. Why do we have to? Because it's your clothes. Well, Sassy like fans. Chelsea, come back. But you did it. Are you for real right now? <laughs> Goober. Alright. We have one bag of stuff to be used later. We have one bag of donate. So we're just gonna put this bag here in the closet. We're gonna put it right up there. So what I've done is, there is a trash bag of stuff right inside this big blue bag. I get these from Ziploc. And that's the stuff Chelsea's gonna use later. And then all of this is for Ashley. But given that's also for Ashley, <laughs> that's why we kind of store it in these bags. Because we have a lot of clothes to pass down to our little squirt over here. Who has now finally earned her screen time for the day. Isn't it like 2 o'clock? What time is it? It's 2.56. 3 o'clock. I haven't even had lunch. Have you had lunch? No. We really start our day late. So maybe we should go get some lunch. Okay. Yeah. All right, so one final, like, this is kind of satisfying for me. Maybe it is for you guys. One more list, last look. We've got all this stuff up here to be used later. We actually left out one little Hawaiian skirt. We're hanging on to hopes of being able to go still. So we're going to leave that guy out, and then let me show you the other side. All right, so this is all for Ashley next fall. We'll kind of leave that as it is and leave it all open on that side. And then this is their buckets for pajamas and underwear. All right, we're just gonna show you the last of our little clean up closet routine. We cut off those little leggings because they had a hole in the bottom of them, right? Yeah, and then we made them into shorts. Into shorts. Can you go put those away for me? I don't have a sewing machine right now, otherwise I would hem them up. But I think they'll be okay, even just like um, pajama shorts, okay? Mm -hmm. Then I just wanted to show you my laundry room. It's kind of the end of that whole clean out. It all ends up back here in the laundry room. So I've got extra hangers brought down here. We have a ton of pant hangers now because we've got rid of a lot of Chelsea's pants. And I have a stock of her hangers. I color coordinate all my hangers for each person. So you can see I don't have <laughs> this person's hangers. And then I have extras of this color because she doesn't have enough in blue. But I've got all the hangers re-lined up and I can do with laundry now. So that is it, you guys. I'm actually just gonna end today's video there because I'm tired. It is five o'clock, you guys. After I cleaned the room, I had to come and put all the hangers away. Oh, I actually have a stockpile that's actually gonna go upstairs as well. So none of these hangers would fit in the laundry room, so I'm gonna actually put these up into my bedroom. So kind of that process of, I have to bring everything down here, see what fits down here, and then take the extra back upstairs, and. Anyway, the whole process takes a lot. Then I showered and kind of got cleaned up, had lunch. But I didn't eat lunch till 3.30. So <laughs> I'm tired and I'm done for the day. So I'm going to call it at just cleaning out the closet. So that's all I needed to do today. So I hope you enjoyed this. And all right, if you're decluttering, let me know what you're decluttering because maybe it's something I haven't thought of yet during this quarantine period. But this is what I do every season anyway for my kids. Now I'm kind of doing it more just for the younger two because my older two now learn, they have learned how to do it. I've taught them how to do it, so they do it themselves. So 
and that's where some of the clothes came from. The clothes that were on top of the shelf, they came from the older girls. They did that themselves, brought the clothes to the younger girls, so that the whole process goes around like the circle of life. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and we will see you next time.